Why do you pay your taxes? Because you're scared of being caught? Or because it's the right thing to do? Tax morale can be defined as the intrinsic motivation to pay taxes, the willingness of taxpayers to voluntarily comply with their tax obligations, beyond the fear of punishment or of being fined. So, why is tax morale important? Voluntary compliance is at the core of tax systems because it reduces enforcement costs. Improving tax morale holds the potential to increase revenues with relatively little enforcement effort. By contrast, the costs of ignoring tax morale are high. Low levels of tax morale can result in tax avoidance, in moves towards the informal sector, and even in the re-evaluation of business or investment decisions in the case of firms. So, what drives people and businesses to pay their taxes? In 2019, the OECD released new findings that shed light on this underexplored topic. At the individual level, research showed that age, education, gender, religion, satisfaction with public services and trust in government all appear to influence tax morale. For businesses, a survey was conducted among more than 1,200 tax officials from over 130 countries and jurisdictions. The survey showed the perceptions of business tax behaviour, indicative of tax morale, vary across regions and revealed the following findings. Some routine compliance is good, officials in all regions perceive that most companies pay on time. But while paying on time is good everywhere, deeper interactions between companies and authorities are more of a challenge. Large regional differences start to appear when we look at officials' views on whether companies respond on time to questions from the authorities. There are further challenges with how open and transparent most companies are perceived to be with revenue authorities. In some regions in particular, their levels of trust are dramatically low. The study also identified one possible solution. Survey responses suggested that tax administration guidelines for dealing with MNEs improve mutual relations. There is a correlation between tax authorities having in place specific guidelines to deal with MNEs and higher levels of trust in the information provided. What comes next? In collaboration with its regional partners, the OECD is setting up regional roundtables on tax morale to open up and deepen the dialogue between tax administrators and business representatives. The results of these conversations will serve to strengthen the relationship between business and governments by feeding into trainings, workshops and new research, identifying technical assistance needs and detecting opportunities for county-specific dialogues. While much remains to be done to build a sustainable taxpaying culture, a greater focus on tax morale can provide a route to increased voluntary compliance for a tax system that is fair and equitable for all taxpayers around the globe.